So Jay, you recently published this book with a co-author. Tell us more about the book. Why did you decide to write the book? And uh, who should be reading that book? Well, so lots of people have had to switch and learn machine learning or learn LLMs very quickly. And so, so many people have to interact with these systems. And the more they will be empowered to use them correctly, the better that they understand them. And so that was the goal of, the, of how to create this educational resource that is highly visual in nature, that is accessible to everybody, that allows developers to build with the models. And so it's built in three parts. The first part is just high level, just a quick history and a breakdown of the technology of what a language model is. And this is a refreshed version of the Illustrator Transformer, basically. So the Illustrator Transformer came seven years ago when the models first came out. How have they evolved since then? How is that different from the latest 2024 era transform? There are some things that have changed, there are things that, that did not change. And so we describe today's transformer as opposed to an old encoder decoder model. We talk about today's positional embeddings, today's um, attention, but that's only the first three chapters. That gives people the main idea. So if somebody understands embeddings, tokenization, and the high level view of how the models work, then they can sort of start to go and build them into systems. And the vast majority of people really only need the second part of it, which is how to use pre-trained LLMs for text classification, how to use them for clustering and topic models, how to use them to build RAG systems, how to do prompt engineering, and how to think about multimodal library models. The late last part, the part number three, is about fine-tuning, and so that's a little bit more for the more advanced users who want to represent or fine-tune an embedding model or text generation model for an advanced uh, use case. So the book is in 400 pages. It has 300 figures that are originally made just for this book.